fresh shrimp. Oh, shrimpers. What up, friends? Harker's Island, North Carolina again, me and Petey. Petey's up there. Say hello, Petey. Hello, hello. We are heading out shrimping today and uh, gonna drop off some stone crab traps because today is the day. There's a picture of the old, there's the old battle axe right there with my traps ready to go. We got some bait and uh, we'll see you on the water. All right, all right, all right. The boat in the water. Go drop off some crab traps. Go do a little shrimping. Ready, Beatty? Yep. Ready. Beatty, how long have we known each other? 84. 84. In two years, it'll be 40 years? Yeah. Holy moly. Yeah, you were a young boy. How could anybody put up with me? All right, we out of here. Some of them are nice. Yeah. 
some of them will end up freezing for bait.
we'll try another mouth of another canal here. But I think that's the honey hole right there because the wind just pushes it all up in there. But we got enough shrimp. Watch for dinner. Shrimp for dinner. It was a great day of shrimp, and we'll have some good food tonight, won't we, Petey? Tonight, we sure will. We sure will. Fresh shrimp. Oh, shrimpers. Well, we're back. Now the fun starts. Here's what, here's Petey, doing what Petey does best. Cleaning shrimp. Tell us what you're doing there, Petey. Cutting off the heads. Cutting off the heads, put the tails to the side. Yep. And then we bag up the bags and a little later I might even uh, make me a little cauliflower, uh, stir fry shrimp cauliflower rice. There you go. Here's why we call her the battle axe. This is parking uh, Bahamas Ferry style right here. Hold on. Oh, damn, the point is gone. All right. Come on, Petey. day of fishing is better than a good day at work so they say right we say Pete. struggle uh, stumbled upon this little tool right here it's shrimp cleaning tool you stick it in down the shrimp you thread it through you pinch the tail and oh, voila oh it didn't work quite as well that good but there takes everything off the shrimp you're ready to go when you're peeling shrimp it's uh, my recommendation would be uh, let them get very cold in the refrigerator it doesn't work real well on shrimp that are like an hour old and aren't very chilled. So like I was trying originally when, when I, a few seconds ago, I was trying to peel the ones we caught today and I actually put them back in the refrigerator and went back to the shrimp that have been in there 
you know, overnight. They're nice and cold, they're crisp, and as you can see, it's a whole different ball game. The peels come right off of them, so. There's nothing like fresh shrimp, especially these shrimp around here. I mean, think about it. There's nothing better than, number one, eating something that you caught and that you spent time and money on. But the second thing is when it comes to shrimp, you know, you don't know where these shrimp are coming from that you get. They could be raised in a, in a you know, aqua farmed in a pond somewhere. I mean, you just never know. And uh, you know, you don't know what they're feeding the shrimp, but well, man, I know what these shrimp are eating and I know where it came from. So, you know, it's just nothing like eating these fresh shrimp. So here we go. Here's my bowl of shrimp for my stir fry. And that took me all of, I don't know, maybe five minutes to do. I'm gonna clean up the shrimp heads here and skins and then we'll get to it. And it should take all of about five minutes to make this dish. All right, step one, two eggs. We are going to quickly scramble these eggs. So they're gonna go in our cauliflower fried rice. Take that and set that aside. At the meantime, we're at the same time, we're also going to put some olive oil. I'm at a different house now, so I don't know where everything is, but I'll get there. Avocado, this is extra virgin olive oil. In a pan, let that get hot. And I don't have any fresh garlic. I don't have any um, so uh, ginger. So I'm going to probably use regular ginger. This is the old green giant. Again, this is a fast. Uh, again, this is a fast meal. So you know. All right, green giant rice veggies cauliflower medley going in the pan. Give our egg a little stir here. Falling in love with that butter. Beauteous, beauteous, beauteous. Into my spice cabinet, I'm going to break out some garlic. There it is, hiding down there. Garlic powder. I'm also going to turn up my burner on my where am I where am I there I am on my rice a little garlic I don't think I have any ginger I would put some ginger on there but I don't think I have any ginger here but that's okay I don't have any of the professor either or Gilligan or Mary Ann, or Mr. Howe, or Mrs. Howe. I think that was everybody. I need heat, I need heat. My eggs, brown, break them up a little bit and turn this burner off. That's for me. Wax for me. Off the burner it comes. Burner's off. So we're going to work this rice about three or four minutes. Some of it's still frozen. Quick and easy here, baby. Quick and easy. Just like the Betty Crocker twins. That mm, probably wasn't appropriate, but hey, sorry. Hey, how about this? A little bacon from breakfast this morning. Woo! Chopped it up. Get that going in there. Oh, yeah. Oh, yeah. I think it's time for the eggs. This rice is screaming eggs. Give me some eggs. 
Give it some eggs. Got the eggs going. Guess what it's screaming for now? Shrimpy Shrimperson. In goes Shrimpy Shrimperson. Get in there, you. Hey, 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 you get in there. Yeah, we're just going to let that work a little bit. Now what's going to happen here in the end is the soy is going to cause them some steam. And that's going to help all of those little shrimp cook. We're going to hit this with some black pepper. Just a little. No salt because the soy is carrying a ton of salt even though I use light soy. Alright, so their shrimp are about half done. We're going to hit it with a little of this soy. Get a little steam rolling in there. I'm a steam roller baby. I'm going to roll right over you. Oh yeah. Falling in, falling in love. Good. I'll see you on the plate. All right, we're ready. We're gonna scoop this in to a bowl. Beautiful, beautiful. Oh, what the heck? Might as well put it all in there. Low carb, very low carb, and delicious. But wait, is that all you got, Brian? No, that's not all I got. How about a little Costco Parmesan cheese on the top? And how about one more touch of pepper? And how about, wait for it, wait for it, it's coming. How about a little Sriracha Love? There you go, folks. Cauliflower, stir-fried cauliflower rice with shrimp. Thank you. Please subscribe and share with all your friends. Take care. Fresh shrimp. Oh, shrimpers.